Hey, Mike, this is for you. Um, yeah, you can set Prime Infrastructure to have notification on backup success and backup failure. And it's pretty straightforward. So, well, it's not so straightforward that I could put it in an email. It's straightforward enough that I felt I needed to record a video to send to you that you can send on to your guys. So, what you do is, under Administration, start with um, Background Task. All right, and then, so here is the task that we're going to key off of. It's Prime Infrastructure Server Backup, this guy right here. So what we have to do is, right now that is set as a notification, but you've got to change it to something like critical, major, warning, that kind of thing, and then you can set your email server to get notified on it. So to do that, we go up to Administration, and we go into System Settings. And then over here, we go up into mm, Severity Configuration. All right. And then here is all the severity. So we're going to look up for backup. So if you do a get to the bottom or do a Control F, backup. It ain't on this page. I think it's on the next page. Yeah, there it is. Configuration backup failed and configuration backup succeeded. Now, I've already turned these into critical, but um, by default, they'll be informational, like this one up above it, uh, this blue circle with the eye in the middle. So they'll need to go into these two, click configuration backup failed, configuration backup succeeded, and up here, say configure security level, and choose anything from critical to, uh, critical to warning critical, major, minor warning, but not informational. You don't uh, notify on informational stuff. So let's say you set it for major. Major, hit go of that. And then um, you need to go then say, I want to get notification on major events. So that you do under mail server configuration. And so they'll have to put all the, their mail server stuff in here. I assume they already have that part and know how to do that. But then here, email notification for individual alarm categories. So then go into the system category here, and you would turn on, I want to get notified on major things. Save that. You'll see that then you have the little major icon here. Save that. And then they'll be good to go. Next time it um, goes off, it will hit a it'll hit a major event, and system major events are scheduled to go email notification, and they'll get their email. All right, you know, uh, what I would honestly do for them, though, is instead of what I showed with major, just do it to critical, what I had it earlier, because everything is critical. I'm pretty sure the backup is a system event, but in case it's something weird like um, application performance or a performance event or something like that, that'll get caught in the uh, critical. So I'd say the easier way is just move to critical, because critical already... Um, defaults to email alerting. And then, oops, let's make sure that the email came in. Slash exe. And here we go. All right. So this is for that. Then I'd actually have to do the backup task. So what I would have to do now is I'd have to go back in here and go to administration and go to my um, background tasks, and go to my prime infrastructure server backup, and say like a run this now. Where are you? I run this now. Um, mm -mm 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 -mm. Where do I hit that? Administration, background tasks. Oh, it's over here. So prime infrastructure background task. And then up here, I say run this now. Okay. So that'll go for 10 minutes. And then at the end of 10 minutes, I'll get an email. I won't wait the video that long for that. All right. Thanks. Take care, Mike. Bye.